stuff that keeps the fantasy in football. The odds were heavily stacked against them. 2-0 down to second division Burnley with just 10 minutes left. Darlington were heading out of the FA Cup last night. But then they staged a sensational comeback to win 3-2 and earn a money-spinning tie in the second round at home to Manchester City. Steve Sutton reports on Darlington's great escape. The celebration said it all. What had seemed impossible ten minutes earlier had been achieved in dramatic fashion. Darlington were through to the second round of the FA Cup. It was quite a comeback, to be honest with you. 2-0 down against a side from a, a high division. Um, it was always going to be a difficult task. I just felt if we could get one, we'd certainly get another one. Whether we'd go on to win the game, I don't know. But I wanted us to try and get back into the game. And if we got a draw, obviously that would have helped us. Uh, uh, without doubt, and at the same time, the financial aspect would have been excellent for our football club. And then to go on and win it, well, I can't really find the words to describe how I feel right now. Playing at Middlesbrough's Riverside Stadium because of the unfit pitch at Feetham's, Darlington and Burnley knew victory would set up a home tie against Manchester City in the second round. But it all went wrong for Darlington as Andy Payton latched onto a bad defensive error to give Burnley a first-half lead. It went from bad to worse as the former Middlesbrough striker added a second from the penalty spot ten minutes into the second half. But Burnley's hero was to prove crucial to the result in more ways than one when he turned villain, sent off for his second bookable offence after a late challenge on the Darlington keeper. Darlington surged forward against the ten-man opposition and got their own penalty with ten minutes left, Brian Atkinson scoring the goal. Even then, a win seemed unlikely, but six minutes later, Mario Dorner pulled Darlington level. And then, with the referee signalling four minutes of injury time, fullback Mark Barnard stepped into the cup limelight with a goal any striker would have been proud of. It was a stunning comeback against second division opposition. Um, we went in at half time and we knew that we could come out and win the game. Um, it's just going from 1 0 down to 2 0 down made it even harder for us. down from heaven when did they let you go has everything in heaven I'd sure like to know yes hooray for darlington